everyone welcome back today I have an unboxing for a girl 10 to 14 with a unicorn theme so after she removes her washcloth this is what she sees when she first opens her box so she has her washcloth right on top is this unicorn headband I picked this up at Walmart for a dollar on clearance she also has on top this unicorn backpack clip. I got this at Walmart as well for 50 cents. And she also has this cute little unicorn figure I picked up at Target in the dollar spot for a dollar. And her wow item right on top is this um, Sparkle Girls Unicorn Doll. She has the little unicorn headpiece and I picked her up for a dollar. It's the only doll I've been able to find for a dollar. So I was really excited about that. She also has this slap bracelet from Walmart that's a unicorn I picked up after Valentine's Day. I believe I paid about 30 cents for it. She has her coloring pencils. She also has this really pretty rainbow pencil pouch I found at Walmart on clearance for 25 cents. And inside the pencil pouch, she has one of the frozen activity kits, a glue stick, a large rainbow eraser, a marker and quite a few pencils. She has five pencils with some extra pencil toppers on there as well. A highlighter, two pens. The small one does write pink. Has this cute little unicorn eraser that I think I picked up in a clearance package of erasers and stickers. A few of the small pencil sharpeners. And she also, of course, has some stickers in here as well some princess, fish, owls, and some My Little Pony. And the last thing in her pencil pouch is this unicorn pen that I picked up at Dollar General. I believe it was on clearance for 15 or maybe 25 cents and it does not have water. It's actually just free flowing glitter in there. So that was it for her pencil pouch. In the back she does have a coloring book and I did put a few stickers in here with some unicorns on it and a unicorn on the coloring book, which I thought went really well. And she also, of course, has her school notebook. She has her pencil sharpener, which also has a little unicorn. Um, it's actually, I think, a Norwal. She has this unicorn keychain I picked up at Dollar General. Um, kind of smushy, if you squeeze it, its eyes pop for 15 cents on clearance. She also has one of the cloud sands I picked up after Easter, a pack of 10 for 50 cents. She has her toothbrush. She also has her comb from the Dollar Tree with the compact mirror inside. And her soap as well. She has a bag so that she can get everything home a little bit easier. And she has this little rainbow pouch I picked up at Dollar General on clearance for 15 cents. And inside, she just has a few accessories. She has a little heart bracelet, a rainbow keychain. She has this heart container I picked up after Valentine's Day at Walmart on clearance. And inside are a few more accessories. She has, whoops, she has a ring. 
this little hair clip and a unicorn necklace which this came in a set of two I got at Walmart on clearance for not Walmart Dollar General I think I paid about a dollar 25 and it came with two of them they were the friendship ones I just removed the small piece that was on here that said I think it said BFF or something like that so I just removed that piece She also has two spiky balls, a top, a noisemaker, and she does have a little outfit, just a plain purple shirt that I picked up at Walmart. And then she has these really cute rainbow leggings that I got at Dollar General on clearance for I think um, maybe a dollar fifteen. She also has this unicorn cross stitch. I picked this up at Dollar Tree. A little notepad with a unicorn on the bottom. This came from after Easter at Walmart. Uh, I paid either three cents or 10 cents. I got a few at different prices. And the last thing in her box is, of course, one of the drawing pads that I made and this kite kit. Um, it comes with two kites. One has a unicorn on it to go with a theme and one has a cat. And I picked this up at Walmart on clearance for 10 cents. So that's everything in this box for a girl 10 to 14 with a unicorn theme. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe if you haven't. And we'll see you next time.